All right, now we're gonna kill this guy. Wait for this guy, though, to pass. He is the one who could see us. Onwards and upwards. Yeah, I think now we should be safe -ish. Okay, but what Wow, well, I'm dying. Oh, that is way too close. Okay, but what I'm just gonna stand in here for a while, okay, as he passes. Make sure he doesn't see me. Now, Mimi, hold on. Why not use this to my advantage? Put okay. the body here. Now that's way too close, come on. Run in the church, he will definitely see it. Is he all, right? all right, and I'll emerge just behind him. And you know what happens next, I guess. Cool. All right, save. Now, who should we attack next? Does this guy see these two? Do these two see each other? They do, which is unfortunate. Maybe I could attract only one guy's attention. I don't know. We'll see. Do these guys see this guy? Maybe he sees him. Let's see. Interesting. I could kill him and attract... I don't know. Oh, hold on. I have a different idea. Maybe I could attract just this guy's attention. By using a clock. Should work. He sees the bodies that way and comes running. That's the plan. He's at it. Wow, I'm and dead. Excellent. Baba, help me. Man, the civilian's going crazy. <gasps> Alright, now, now comes the difficult part though. Now we do have again two soldiers Mom. right at the same spot. I could just make them run. I will probably catch one of them, I guess, at some point. Let's make them, though, uh, disperse a bit, run, like, a bit past me. I'm gonna emerge from this door. I do not want them to be able to hear me as I do that. So let's put the bodies a bit further away than the door, from the door. Now, let's see. I'm gonna attract only one guy's attention, but they're probably both gonna get activated anyway. I'm just trying it just in case. This is the exception to the rule. Okay then. What? Yeah, you see, both of them get activated indeed. Bad people. Oh, and only this guy comes. Okay, then we're gonna take advantage of that. Definitely. I'm dying. Kill. Give me this. Go back in. We got it. Save this as danger because the other guy has gone somewhere. I do not have any idea where. There he comes. Now he probably should come investigate the bodies himself. Excellent. And I guess in this case we got kind of lucky. <sighs> well, okay, we gotta reload that though, because I was a bit impatient. Mommy. <laughs> Wait for him to look a bit away. But in this case we were kind of lucky, two guys. He's at it. Standing right next to each other actually took different routes towards the enemy bodies. But it worked, so we'll take it. Right, time for a hard save. This is a good spot. Alright, now I think we effectively can go and activate the doctor who's standing right here. Hurry up, Doc. Things are getting too hot around here. Darn it, I'm getting too old for all this. <gasps> <laughs> Remember which movie says I'm too old for this shite. Lethal weapon. This guy kind of sounds like this. He can unlock the door. Let's do that. Hmm. Why not? Just in case we need to duck into cover quickly. It could be useful. Onwards and upwards. Where do we go from here? And at this point, we could actually just bring everybody along. Why not? Be careful not to get uh, stampeded, trampled by this uh, <laughs> by this carriage here. I'm just gonna put everybody inside the church for safekeeping mostly. Because sometimes you carry out your plans in one part of the uh, of the map and enemies get activated on the other where you have exposed one of your uh, desperados. Don't want that to happen. 
All right, now we're safe. Now let's start going on a murder spree, I guess. This guy is kind of exposed. I mean, this guy is sort of looking at him. I could put a body in his vision. Make things interesting. Actually, he goes away. Let's belay that plan. Just gonna kill this guy for now. Now, though, a natural trail of bodies is forming. I'm gonna let this play out, see how it goes. I see the first guy gets activated. Help me. Start going all over the map. Oh man, his vision is gone because another civilian took it away. Oh, now everybody's gonna start getting activated. I don't know if this was a good plan. Oh, he's gonna take the long route though. <laughs> this guy's gonna go all right the way around the train to come to us. Let's let this play out, see how it goes. I'm kind of curious at this point. Now, this guy is kind of activated, but not really. All right, where's our cowboy? There he is. Let's keep an eye on him. Save this as danger, actually. Ah, he should come looking to the other bodies as well, right? Not Let's see. There he goes. On to the next pile. Oh, man, come on. Where are you going? <laughs> Oh, this guy is all sorts of crazy. Come on. Yeah, these guys are going crazy. In any case, that gives me the time to kill this guy, maybe. I mean, why not? Let's take the chance. Desperado. Take this guy out of the equation. At least we did do, the, okay. do that. The funny part now is I know for a fact Let's keep saving this as danger. I know for a fact that this other guy, this other cowboy that is going crazy here. Let's see if we can uh, spot him on the map. Here he comes again. He saw these bodies here, so he has to come investigate. That's like his duty. There you go. Man, I swear to God, the feature that the uh, developers have implemented where they change the vision. I mean, if I designate the vision on one guy, it means I, I need it there. Don't change the vision. Okay, but what now? Especially on civilians. Civilians are kind of useless. You should never Mommy. switch to their vision. Oh. Well, we're kind of safe right now, interestingly enough. So let's see. Who's the next guy we're going to take out? Maybe this guy sees far away enough. Yeah, we could place this body inside his vision, maybe. Desperado. Let's put it like, I don't know, here maybe. Yeah, that didn't work out too nice. Does this guy see that far? He actually does. Interesting. So I'm gonna put this inside his vision then. Why not? And then run the same thing again. Oh, we're gonna have to wait for the train to go away. All right, I'm gonna do some um, some cleanup here. Put the bodies a bit further away from the church. And we'll wait for the train, maybe, to leave. As soon as it does, this guy should notice the body. Okay, but what now? All right, now the train is leaving again. Let's see if these guys notice the bodies. Hopefully they do. Yes. Kind of getting yellow, but not too much. How about this guy? Yeah, they might need some assistance. I don't know. We got here. A desperado. Stop switching the vision game, Jesus. We got here. I'm gonna try and make him see me a bit. Okay then. Jesus, the game. Switching the visions. Stop doing that. Does he care now? Man, he still doesn't care. Come on. <laughs> Onwards and up. This is your fallen comrade, damn it. Show some respect. Oh, and now he gets activated. <laughs> right before the train comes. Let's see how this plays out. Yeah, he's gonna run all around the train. I don't know why these guys do not take this route here. Why their pathfinding is so wacky. Like, you should go this route, take this uh, opening, run towards the body. Instead, he opts to run towards the other side of the train. 
I don't know. I'm guessing the logic is that the train keeps moving forwards and it is dangerous to do that. I think he's coming now. Let's save this as danger. Now, hopefully he doesn't get all crazy. Come investigate the rest of the bodies, please. Yes, he comes. This pile as well. Oh, man. He goes crazy again and goes back. <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to wait for him to come back. He will in a sec, I guess. All right, and now I can see him in the minimap coming back. Save this again as danger. And hopefully now he will resume watching this pile of bodies. Indeed, he does. And good night. Wow, I'm dying. Excellent. Let's save. And let's see who remains. This guy. Now we need to attract his attention. I bet... Oh, hold on. He will see us like that, though. But if I put a body, like, on the other side of the tracks... I mean, come on. Should be able to see it now. Onwards and upwards. Yeah, he gets yellow. Come on, there you go. Come down. Come down, sir. Okay, but what now? Oh, man, that damn train, though. <laughs> it's kind of throwing a wrench in my plans. Because he, they always have to go like the other way. See, he takes the long route as well. Jesus Christ. Ah, let's wait for him. All right, and here he comes. I should probably just take out the, uh, I don't know, maybe the driver of the train at some point. Like this guy here. Let's punch him out of commission, maybe. I don't know. Because he keeps operating the train and... Uh, where is this guy standing? Is he standing behind the train? Oh, that guy is stuck behind the train. Interesting. You know what? Hold on. Can I use that to my advantage? Can I put him out of his misery? I have no idea where he's standing exactly. We got it's kind of tricky. There he is. Wow, nice. <laughs> we got here. Did I take my knife back? I actually didn't. Where is my knife? <laughs> now, let's go back in the church just to save. Right now, let's actually continue murdering people here. Now we got... Hold on, we could actually form a trail of bodies here. Okay, what now? Let me see. Where should I lead the enemies, though? There's not a, a lot of room to work with. Like, this guy is watching these guys as well. Okay, but what now? I'm just gonna kill him for now. Well, I'm Hello? Dying. Are you all right? Could kill this guy as well, but I'm gonna take his body away. I don't want the other guy to notice right now, maybe. And now let's save and let's see. This guy patrolling here. I don't know if I can take him out right immediately. Maybe I could. Uh... How far do these guys see? Oh man. It would be much more interesting if I could engage from this side. So maybe let's see if we can do that. Maybe let's place a body right where this guy can see it. Like close to the saloon. We are right on the edge of the level here. I saw something. Oh, is somebody informing on me? This guy is informing. Oh. Interesting. He's not coming to look though. Hold on, let's place the body here. I'm gonna hide behind there. Okay, but what now? Just throw my knife when this guy comes investigating. On the right. Oh, there is another guy coming investigating there. Interesting. It's not the one I care about though. Hey, what's with you? Well, we could take advantage. Oh. There you go. Okay, cool. Can we take two swings, like, right away, right now? Stop right okay, there. But what now? Hey. All right, that didn't work too nicely because I ran and somebody heard me. Let's actually try and walk here. I only want this guy activated. Oh, he doesn't get activated, though. Interesting. How about this guy? Is he going to inform on me? Let's see. He activated the last soldier, so maybe he'll do that again. What up? I think they went that way. 
Oh, interesting. He is gonna go and gather soldiers here. Where is he gonna send them? Oh, this guy comes. Hold on. There you go. Give me that. Ah, let's quickly go in. There's gonna be lots of enemies coming here. I don't want part any any part of this action right now. I'm gonna save, but I'm gonna wait this out. Maybe if one enemy lingers behind, we'll take him out. We'll see. Something's wrong here. He's not gonna get up again. Yeah, they all kind of move in sync here. So I don't know. Maybe the maybe this guy. Come on. Get out of here. Oh, oh, Okay, I took quite a bad shot here. Let's do that again. Hey. This is, in case you're wondering, he kind of saw me because I'm on wood. Yeah. Right, there's a wooden surface here, and as soon as I step up on it, he knows I'm there. So I have to actually target him faster. Let's save this as danger here. Which is not easy because he's standing behind a friggin' building. Get out of here. There you go. We made it count this time, though. Is this guy an enemy? No, he's not. He's just a civilian. All right, cool. Okay. And I think we can save this now. Didn't go exactly as planned, but still. There really isn't any plan here, to be honest with you. All right, now, I think this enemy is kind of standing on his own there. Could just go up and uh, kill him, maybe. Onwards and upwards. Something's wrong here. Oh! All right, let's place this body maybe here behind the door. If somebody sees this body, I could hide in here and just knife him in the back. That's the idea behind it. We got here. Or we could just go in and activate kid. Let's see, does this guy see? Now nah, he doesn't see that far. I could go and uh, emerge on his backside and kill him though, still. Like just casually stroll behind him. Don't go on the wood. Oh, these guys will see, though. Hold on. These guys will get activated. So let's do something a bit... A bit more elaborate, I guess. Could put this body... Maybe smack down in the middle of the street as well. Why not? Or over here. Then hide in this building. Onwards and upwards. Is this free? Yes, it is. Okay, then. Man, all sorts of civilians running around crazy. Well, obviously, if you live in a town full of dead people, you would be kind of concerned, <laughs> I guess. Now, let's see how this guy reacts now. Save this as danger. Is he all right? No, he's not all right. Go check it out. There you go. Now you're dead too. Don't. Don't. Now let's go activate Kate, maybe. Bandits. Kate, we gotta get out of here. I just love riding next to you, John. That's a response. <laughs> that was weird. All right, hold on. Now, do we have any enemies activated here? There's a guy standing there, which is kind of weird. What is he looking at? We should go and kill him. There's a few enemies running around like crazy. You can see you gotta be you gotta be careful with that. <laughs> this could get out of hand. And another enemy coming over there, interestingly enough. I could just run and kill him, let's see. Oh. Because why not? He gave me the chance. I might as well take him out. Okay, then. All right, now, we do have uh, a few enemies here still. This guy going ballistic. Let's actually hide John Cooper inside this building. This body pile seems to be very attractive to enemies, okay. so you never know. This guy resides in this spot, in this area. So he will now see a fresh body and get activated. He has seen the other two, I think, but he hasn't seen the third one. Now, see, he gets activated. Does he? Yes. Let's save us danger. Come on. There you go. 
And this is uh, largely the work of civilians here, believe it or not. They go around running, activating everybody. Sometimes they're useless, they just run in fear. Sometimes they do actually inform of you, which is making things a bit interesting. Right now... now <laughs> is this guy gonna run all the way to them to activate them? Let's see. Now, this could be interesting. He only activates one guy. Oh, this could be a kill of opportunity. Hold on. Let me quickly run behind this guy. See if I can take him out this way. Well, I yeah, indeed I can. Excellent. Now maybe... Oh, hold on. He will see this body. He's dead. Go investigate. Many. Lot, lots of... Lots of skills of opportunity here. Let's actually uh, quick save this now. What a mess. <laughs> we could actually just effectively clear everybody in this area. If we want to. Like this guy, for example. Let's take him out next. Is he gonna come all the way down? He is. Interesting. We got it. Right, go check the bodies out. Wow, I'm dying. Because these guys are guarding the horse, the last horse that I need. All right, another guy. Should I actually be brave and approach him? Let's see what he does. I bet he's gonna stop at some point. Or I could just place a body in his vision. I shouldn't maybe get too aggressive. He's gonna come on his own, maybe. Onwards and or he'll stop there. That's, uh... That's fine, too. You should never turn your back to a desperado, though. Fatal mistakes. All right. Any remaining enemies? Let's just clear house. Why not? I could go and kill this guy as well now. Should we? I don't know. Hold on, though. Let's walk. Let's not run because this is a wooden surface. I don't know where this guy can see. He's just standing there. He might... Yeah, he can... Uh, oh, he can actually take me out and hear me very fast. So let's not do that again. Hold on. I'm going to kill this guy again. And maybe actually let's run on his backside. Kill him that way. I don't know why I'm doing this. I guess it's when I, whenever I see a last enemy remaining. I don't know. I kind of just want to clear house, you know. <laughs> now, I have no idea where he is. I know he's behind the train somewhere. And you got to be careful because there's lots of civilians as well. Like, I'm gonna save the game, and I do not know who I'm gonna hit here. I actually hit the enemy. Nice. <laughs> Excellent. I was kind of afraid I would hit a civilian, but now we have cleared the house, effectively. Well, there's two enemies remaining here, but come on. I mean, <laughs> let's get not, not get too crazy. Where is John Cooper going? He is kind of stuck. All right, then. Now. Upwards and upwards. Now we go to the second part, steal four horses, go to the guard station, which is down there south. Let's have John hop onto this horse, and everybody else slowly emerge. Was easy. Is John stuck again? Yeah, John is stuck again. Look at him. <laughs> Onwards and up. I guess they didn't call the train correctly in this case. All right, let's go down this side. John, come on. Let's actually get everybody here. Where is the doctor? Man, it's okay. been such a long time. I literally here? used nobody else to finish this mission. Except for John Cooper. All right, John, get on your high horse. What now? And you, sir. Wow, there's a horse missing. Oh, no, there it is. <laughs> it just wandered off just a bit. All right, you go there. Kate goes on this horse. Let's make sure that everybody is still moving. Bring John here as yeah. well. You can open up the minimap just to see if everybody is indeed moving. Sometimes they get stuck on the train, for example. Okay. Now we're waiting for Kate, the slowest member of our party, I guess. As soon as it comes, though, I think we're done with this level. 
Let's bring the doctor closer. All right, and we should be good. I think we might need to take a road and escape south. All right, so we should go this route. That was kids play. God damn it, John, what have you done now? The entire town is after us. I'll tell you why we're riding. Let's get out of here first. We're going to Fortezza. Fortezza? Yep, we're gonna free Sanchez. He's the only one that can help us now. Sanchez? Seems to me you've got a lot of explaining to do, John. Later, let's get going. Yeah!